Are you ready to join the investigation? Well, you came to the right place. Welcome to Local History. I am Miguel Sanchez, and in this episode, we invite you to escape out of the ordinary with the subject of this episode, Court TV Mystery. Whew, the channel that was formerly known as Escape. Are you ready? Then let's join the investigation on Court TV Mystery. Let's begin with a short part of those who don't know what Court TV Mystery is. Court TV Mystery, forward escape, satellites as Escape is an American free-to-air television network owned by the Cats Broadcasting subsidiary of the E.W. Scripps Company. It focuses primarily on mystery and crime programming. It is available in several media markets via the digital sub-channels of terrestrial television stations and on the digital tiers of select cable providers through a local affiliate of the network. It mainly competes with digital multicast networks such as Ion Television, which I already talked about on episode 8 of Local History, this TV, movies, and Get TV. About this TV, movies, and Get TV, I'll talk about all those in future episodes, so please keep an eye out for those. As for Ion Television, I already talked about it on episode 8 of Local History. If you haven't seen it yet, I highly recommend you go watch it right now. But for now, with that being said, let's get right into the local history of Court TV Mystery. 2013 to 2019, the channel was launched as Escape. We have the word Escape in black text, but the letter P is uh, it's ascended just a little bit, and, and the top part is cut off. Looks like the, it's like a secret to crime. Secret to crime, you mean? Anyways, anyways, here's the alternative version. And 2019 to the present, they changed the name to Court TV Mystery, so we have the word court in black text. On the right, there is a uh, red finger print, and on it, there's the word TV in a negative space. Under it, there's the word mystery in black text. Also, uh, also on the left of, uh, of the words court and mystery, there's a red, there's a, there's a black slash that's cutting the, uh, uh, that's cutting the diagonal part of the letter M in mystery. That's because we invited you to join the investigation. Ooh, it's a mystery. But other than that, thank you so much for watching. We hope you guys enjoyed this episode of Local History. Please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Hit the notification bell so that way you do not miss a single episode when it comes out. And I believe that is pretty much it. So with that in mind, thank you so much for watching. I believe you guys such as you be yourself, and I'll see you next time for another new episode of Logo History. We're going back to the Children's Networks next time for episode 84, where, where we're going to take a look at another Nickelodeon channel nobody cares about. That's why, for episode 84, next time, we're taking a look at Nicktoons. You you do not want to miss it. We'll see you guys there for every here on Logo History. I'll be you Thanks a lot. I'll see you on the next one. Take care, guys. Laters.